My name is Lucas Assis. I'm one of the developers behind the Gimmer platform. This is part one of a series of tutorials on how to get the best out of the Gimmer dApp. Today's video is about creating an account in Gimmer, backing up the account with the private key or the key store file, and importing this backed up account into a fresh instance of Gimmer. So let's start. We can go ahead and hit create account. Be aware that the custom name cannot repeat inside your local Gamer instance account list. So I'm just gonna name it test tutorial account. And I'm gonna get a test password. Test password. The Gamer account is internally an Ethereum wallet. That is the same wallet that holds the necessary GMR to run the dApp. Now you should provide a strong password. This is the password that Gamer will use to cryptograph your account. The security of your account is as strong as your password, so make sure you don't lose it. So, I'm just gonna tape here my account. And you can just hit create account. After this, your account has been created and you are inside Gimmer. To actually back up my account and see all, all the other stuff that we can do, I'm gonna go here to my profile. And you can see on this menu, we can see the, the account name, which you can even change, and the address of the wallet. We have some settings here, but now we're going to focus on the backup. So we're just going to hit backup here, and now we, you can see that we have private key and key store. Currently, we have two ways to backup your account, either private key or key store. The main difference is that the private key doesn't need a password to, to restore your account, but the key store actually needs. The key store is a file that will need to be saved on your system, but it still needs the password. So if you save, if you backup your account by using the key store, you still need the key store and the password. But if you backup using the private key, you only need the private key to get your account back. So let's first, let's first try exporting using the private key. On the password field, let's just type the password of your account and I can hit export private key. The private key will be displayed on screen, as you can see here. Copy it or write it down. Make sure you don't lose it or let anyone read it. The private key can be used to import your account back with no password, so make sure no one steals this and it's stored safely. This is like an access to all your GMR funds, so make sure you don't lose this. So let's start let's start exporting it on the other on the other way. So we can change from private key to key store. I type the same password again, which is the password for my account. You can just hit export key store. And you can see I already exported mine here. And you just type the path and just save it there. Okay, so now let's go around importing this account back into Gamer. Okay, so I just reinstalled Gamer so I can have a fresh version with no accounts. So we can better recover the key and test everything right. So let's just go here. I'm gonna go and actually recover the account. And we have several fun several ways to actually recover the account. So currently it's three ways. So let's first try by importing a key store file. I'm just gonna hit upload JSON file. Grab my key. I'm gonna type the exact same password that I used on when I created this account because I need this exact same password to be to decrypt the key store file. And I'm gonna set up a new tutorial account name. I'm just gonna need a tutorial account. I'm gonna hit import. So as you can see here in my profile, we have the same address, same Twitter account, everything is alright, we just imported it. So let's try importing it now with the private key. Okay, so now that I have another fresh version of Gamer, let's try importing it with the private key. So I'm just gonna hit the recovery account, and I'm gonna change to private key. I'm gonna place the private key of my, of my account. I'm gonna set up a new account name, this is gonna be Twitter account. Again, and now actually, because this is a private key and not a key store, we can actually set up a new password. This doesn't need to be the last password because the, the private key is already decryptographed, so we just need to set up a new password. So I'm just going to type a new password here and hit import. So your account should be imported and we should be at the dashboard again. So this is Gimmer. So this was it for the general account management on Gimmer. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.